Join me as I challenge myself to get book summaries without reading a single page using Notebook LM. In this video, you'll discover how Notebook LM can transform your reading experience by providing book summaries without the need to read the entire text. Because many people struggle to find time to read books, yet they want to absorb valuable knowledge and insights from them. We've all been there, surrounded by stacks of unread books, look at them behind me, feeling guilty for not having time to get through them all. The truth is that our busy lives often get in the way of our desire to read and learn. Even with audiobooks and ebooks, finding the time to consume them can be tough. That's probably why you haven't read my book Service Stacking yet. And let's be honest, who hasn't started a book only to lose interest halfway through? Reading can be a monumental task and it's easy to get discouraged. But what if I told you there's a way to get the essence of a book without reading it to cover to cover? A way to absorb the most important information in a fraction of the time it takes to read the entire book. We'll explore how Notebook LM works, its key features, and how it efficiently summarizes content to give you the essence of any book. Notebook LM is an AI-powered tool that uses natural language processing to condense complex text into concise summaries. It's like having a personal research assistant at your beck and call. With Notebook LM, you can focus on the most important information, skipping the fluff and getting straight to the point. The tool is designed to save you time and energy, allowing you to absorb knowledge quickly and efficiently. Notebook LMs, their algorithms are trained on a vast amount of text data, enabling it to identify patterns and relationships that humans might miss. The interface is also user-friendly, making it easy to upload your desired text or book, and voila, you'll get a summary in seconds. Notebook LM is the perfect solution for busy individuals who want to stay ahead of the curve without sacrificing their precious time. Now, the real magic happens when you see a live demonstration of Notebook LM in action, summarizing a popular book in mere seconds. And that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so here we are inside of Notebook LM, summarizing the book Built to Last by Jim Collins. And how do you summarize this? How do you summarize a book? First of all, you got to get some sources. First, you can have the PDF of the book or the whatever you have. If you've already purchased the book, the ebook version of it, of course, that makes sense to have the book in there. You notice there's a lot of YouTube videos in here. Now, how do you get to that point? Well, all you got to do is you got to add source and you can choose YouTube videos in here and then you got to find them. So here's how you find them. First of all, if you type in the word built to last, there's a lot of ambiguity in there. Okay. There's a lot of different items in here. Um, there's like the Grateful Dead videos I saw. There's all kinds of interesting things on here. But if I type in built to last Jim Collins, and then you could even put summary if you want to, but we don't even need to do that. And then you say you want it to be over 20 minutes. And then you go through here and you find there's actually a lot of times where Jim's talking about this. Jim's on stage talking about it. So um, here's one right here. Uh, for, uh, keynote, day, day one keynote from 14 years ago. I mean, this, is, this book is that old, 60 minutes. That's gold right there. So you take this, you take the YouTube link, you drop it into your notebook, which is probably already in there. I'm just going to show you the demonstration purpose. You get all these things in there, and now you are getting to the point where you have a summary of everything that's in there. Now, Notebook LM in the background will read through everything. They'll pull in the details, as you can see, and then you can start querying it. Now, like I said, this is book club at our company. So what's the benefit of book club? It's basically telling you what you should be doing for your business and what should we be implementing. So you can start querying this notebook and say, what should we be doing as an action of this book? And it will give you a summary. Um, you can see we have these little notes that we've already shared, um, a detailed briefing document, an analysis. Um, okay, don't be afraid of change. Okay, so this is a summary of the book. Define and commit to a core ideology. Yeah, I, I actually read this book and that, that was a big takeaway for me, but you can see that's referenced over and over again. Set a big BHAG, big, hairy, audacious goal. It's great. That's part of Jim Collins's other book as well, Good to Great, one of my favorite books. Create a cult-like culture. These are th Those are actually my three biggest takeaways from this, from this book. Um, embrace branching and pruning. Focus on clock building, not time telling. That's really interesting, right? Preserve the core while stimulating progress. This is an example they give in the book, which uh, honestly, you don't need, do I need to give you an example from the book or is it just there? You need to keep your core business intact while stimulating progress. So don't, don't just say my business is only my core business. My business is what, we, what makes us money right now plus the future. So you're investing in things like research and development. Um, ensure alignment, make sure everybody's aligned. Now this is from the, the book, um, good to great, get people in the right seats and then, or get the right people on the bus and make sure they're in the right seats. This is key to that as well. 
prioritizing people. And, and, you know, there's lots of examples in the book, which again, I did read that one, but you wouldn't even need that to know that it's not just about individuals. It's about people making decisions and having autonomy, being disciplined, acknowledge the brutal facts, confronting it. This is, this is pretty much every business book ever. But if you read this, you'd say, yeah, that's actually a pretty good point. Learn from your failures, emphasize high quality of service. This is something that I'm really big on. I talk to it, uh, my business partner Mercer about this all the time on our podcast is that we think that in the future with the AI economy, service is what's going to help you differentiate service, brand, being luxury, being high perception of value. That's going to be the 1% of businesses that their model is going to translate into this new world. Um, anything that's commoditized, anything that's lower value, or it's really just fact checking and just, just spitting out facts is not going to do very well. So I always emphasize service. Service is really important as opposed to you know support, for example. Recognize, celebrate the successes of your team, and don't be afraid of change. Pretty good summary. I just saved you the four hours that I was listening to this thing on Audible right there. Now, what do you miss when you don't listen to a book? Um, a little bit. You list, list like the point where your mind wanders and you're thinking about things and you're going through stuff. Well, what happens if you just look at this? If you do the audio overview? If you haven't done that yet, you can do the audio overview. Um, we do a lot of stuff where we're interacting with the audio overview and we're asking it questions and talking to it. Um, you can get your study guides. You can get your briefings in there. Um, you can just look at the summary and you can get a lot. So you can, you know, if, if you're if you're an examples person, what company examples are there of um, setting B hags? Okay. So you just, you go through it. You actually just, you query each one. So if you want examples, if that's what you go into, it's all in there, okay? Nike, their BHAG hey, was to crush Adidas. SpaceX is to enable humans to live on other planets. This has actually probably been updated. SpaceX didn't even exist when this book was published, but it, you can see from all the different YouTube videos, Jim Collins is, is talking on stage, updating it. He might not have released a new version of the book, but it's out there. P&G, their BHAG is to create steady employment. It's sort of boring. Boeing was to you know build a jet, a commercially viable jetliner. That was huge for them. Now, Boeing's got through some trouble since then. The funny thing is a lot of these, this is like one of those things that might make you lose trust in this book is that some of these companies are not doing super well now. Like GE is a pretty big example they give. Philip Morris, they've already, you know, basically whatever. Um, they're, you know, so, so you got you to take it with a grain of salt. But that's the idea here is that you're not having to listen to the example of what they did it like this is pretty much what i got out of it if you were to just say jeff what did ford motor company do it was democratizing the the automobile um, if you were to say jeff what did sony do sony started out as like a, a failed product company and they're they wanted to change the global perception of japanese products this is all right from the book right from jim collins's mouth but now it's right to your eyes and to your ears whether you're watching listening to the video or um, whatever it is you are getting the summary and you're doing it in minutes 19 minutes total however long it takes you to watch this video so i highly encourage you to implement Implement this method and to use Notebook LM. There's so many things we can do on Notebook LM. So when you get to the point where you're reading the comments, do let me know if you want to see more of these demos of Notebook LM. We have so many notebooks right now that we're using for this level of knowledge. I'd love to share it with you. I'd love to see what you think. So let me know in the comments if you like this and you want to see more of this type of video. And now that you've seen the summary, imagine being able to grasp the main ideas of any 300 plus page book in just a few minutes. It's truly mind blowing. And you can see how it can transform the way you consume and process information, making you more efficient and productive. And in just a few clicks, Notebook LM can summarize an entire book, extracting the most important information and presenting it in a clear, concise manner. And that's why if you're like me, you're already amazed at how quickly you can absorb knowledge and insights from books without having to dedicate hours to reading. Notebook LM is a perfect tool for anybody looking to enhance their knowledge and skills without sacrificing their busy schedule. The benefits of using Notebook LM are endless. Not only will you save time, but you'll also be able to absorb knowledge more efficiently, making you more productive and effective in your daily life. Whether you're a student looking to get ahead in your studies, a professional seeking to stay up to date with industry trends, or someone who just loves to learn, Notebook LM is the perfect solution for you. So in summary, Notebook LM is a game changer for busy individuals looking to enhance their knowledge without dedicated hours of reading. And if you found this video helpful, be sure to check out the other videos on this channel on productivity tools, business, measuring your business, and also leave your thoughts in the comments below. And if you want to have a private discussion with people who are just as passionate as I am about this, make sure you go to measureyou.com and check out our community.